Ukrainian saboteurs successfully operate behind Russian forces. The Ministry of Defense of Germany has analyzed the course of military operations in Ukraine, which indicates that Ukrainian military forces are attempting to weaken the Russian army through diversions far beyond the front line. According to BUILD, citing the report, pro-Ukrainian sabotage groups disrupted the main railway connection in the territory of the Zaporizhia region occupied by Russian forces. Furthermore, the railway in occupied Crimea came under attack by saboteurs. According to the Ministry of Defense of Germany, this proves that Ukrainian forces can still operate in regions under Russian control far beyond the front line. The German ministry is also analyzing the sabotage of an ammonia pipeline in the Kharkiv region in early June. The report states that Ukraine's involvement in the destruction of the ammonia pipeline cannot be ruled out. As stated by the German Ministry of Defense, Russian occupation forces are defending the front line from prepared positions with all available forces. At the same time, the Russian army increasingly relies on aerial, missile and unmanned attacks to inflict losses on Ukrainian forces. Russian forces are under pressure in the area of Bakhmut, pointed out the German agency. Additionally, the Russian army presumably no longer controls the entire city. Earlier, Colonel Margot Grossberg, chief of the Estonian Defense Forces Intelligence Center, stated that the armed forces of Ukraine are conducting reconnaissance to identify weak points in the defensive positions of Russian occupation forces. According to him, there will be no active counter-offensive operations in the coming week.